The news summary, good evening. Students in state schools have accessed and have read thousands of books through a virtual library. This has been possible through a computer program called Mayon, which has more than 7,000 online books. The Renaissance Learning Program in Seychelles started back in 2019 as a pilot project in five schools. The person responsible for the project, Cyril Pile, says that at the moment, all schools can participate in the Renaissance Learning Program and access Mayon. And today's webinar was to meet and take stock after one year and see how we're doing. And from the, the evidence gathered from the statistics, we've seen that pupils are reading a lot, a lot, and they are reading a variety of books. And from um, uh, feedback received from school, pupils are improving in their reading, improving in their reading comprehension. And today's webinar also was uh, aimed at um, uh, sharing um, uh, you know, success stories so that schools can learn from each other. Because with, this, with our ministry's new strategic direction, we want schools to, um, you know, to work together, schools to, to take matters in their own hands and find ways and means to improve uh, attainment. And this, and, this, and this reading program gives them this golden opportunity for them to, you know, to um, work with their pupils, to, to make use so as to improve reading and um, ultimately pupils will also improve in other subjects. The way forward is definitely for us to reinforce what we've been doing and get more pupils to, to access um, uh, the, the online library, um, uh, have uh, what we call further follow-up after pupils have read, see how we can further develop their reading comprehensions, you know, in terms of, um, uh, you know, Re um, direct reading in terms of reading between the lines, um, uh, supporting pupils having certain reading difficulties. Space to park cars for hire at the international airport is a big problem that the Car Hire Association says they are facing. This is one among many points of discussion during a virtual meeting between the Car Hire Association and the SCAA. Vincent Padeyashi, the chairperson of the association, said that they discussed many points affecting their businesses at the airport. Apart from a parking space, the overcrowding situation at the arrival where the car hire kiosks are situated is also a concern. The SEA Commercial Director General, Mrs. Florence Marego, have addressed the parking space problem and said that the other points are being discussed. And that's it for this news summary. I'll be back at 8 for the Creole Bulletin. Bye-bye for now.